this night you program talk to the camera we can meet you on a daily basis today we can work her now the mount oil community for find out from them the challenges them whether they go through things them whatever let like government help them with now we they go to the chief and other people in this community for get for away from them good afternoon and welcome to this interview you go tell me your name and your position at the mount oil community me na chief samba chief parliament is samba sisi and me na the chief na mount oil so how long you don't take as chief? I don't take more than ten years as chief now. All right. So what are your experience so far as chief? My experience is too great. I do the material for the people with the community. So like as chief so far, what are some of the constraints the moment that go through the material community? Well, the constraints then too much. One. The light will tell God thank you small and, uh, and the government and the water room in all day. When then they make this road, we don't tell the people and say, let this road come with the water. The water business now a problem now. Now I will constrain. Mostly the constrain now, now water now this community. We will not get better pump them pass then they will don't kiss road for me and get water. Yeah. But then, um, speaking of constraints, we're not to get any challenge with health issues. I mean, Mount Oya is a very big community, but then we're not get any health center where the sports is sick in the care and go there. Yes, we get health center. But this health center, mess in all day. Now, we they try to get, we they try for talk to get free uh, medical. The free medical, it goes to the Bele woman and they pick in them. But right now, if Bele woman go to the hospital, mess in all day. If you can keep picking go on the age, we day below five years, you know go get better medicine. You see, then one time we've been good in our hospital, then we go, then they will get I mean, I mean, things then for we make them check the people then with a proper checking. You see, the below man then the strain, the picking them then the strain. See, so medicine all day. So waiting at the health center. You see, then we not get this BP machine, we them for the check the I mean, people them, we them will know them blood pressure and this and that, we not get them seen at the health center. You see, so now you can send them at the health center. But if you not get watchman self, you no health center in Mount you not get watchman. We need watchman. That's our main problem down there. And then they are about the people them, who they can work on it, if the woman did it on it, Chief man then they come around for me then go arm them people and they watch man all day. You see? So now we have main problem then the one then they. The health center no get water. One water no day at the health center. So how we go do? We they put that to the government more than go help with. Okay. You but see? then um now the Mantoya community, how now on a main source of getting water? Well main source of getting water, first we go in the streams, then water well them. We then they nearby, you see, and then then they it can dry. Not to how long they get water day. If they dry, when the dry season they come to, uh, they strain them, constrain them too much for the water business. You see, we know you get water. Right now, we they get half and half. When you go say this you now, January, December, January, February, ah, uh, trust me, pass with the road down. Pass the road down, it's road, use containers them. For me to get water, it's raining really too much. So they appeal to the government. Do you are ready with the council? Let come with water. The Guma Valley, let them come with water for we. Now Mount Aurelia. Um, as chief concerning peace, what is the experience when they get in the Mount Royal community? We get for do with peacekeeping. Peacekeeping. Well, that's why they are getting commander now. We na junior Niku. In the tell you mostly about peacekeeping. Because we will get more threats from the chief man there and the other people then. But we will get them CSVR, local police partnership, but then they, Salon police then, then they will then CSVR, then they will tell you more about peacekeeping. Okay, um, as chief, I believe so you get influence more over you people then. How you can able for influence them for keep peace in Sierra Leone? Well, the people then, we didn't amount to well. Really, the peace. We now in Mount Royal, me the chief, I try to keep the peace with me, CSV them. Because 
Where will they talk about peace? Not to me one going to work. I get people and why they send go around the community where they go and keep people and quiet. I get them. Okay, um, earlier on you speak about the hospital, the challenges they make Unari get. As chief, Una don't, I mean, you don't go any further for meet government and try for talk to them about that? Yes. We've been there one meeting down PMO. I tell them that the things that we're not doing at the hospital, let them try for visit the hospital, let them correct the hospital. Okay, but what's not your message with them tell you? Well, then self tell me back, say, make me self send message to the to the government. Now I say, but we're not the government. Now the PMO, now they're in charge of the hospital. So if we're not in charge of the clinic, then things then shut in at the clinic. At least now I'll go for green message country. If you now ask me back, I will do my best. When God make un and then this radio message don't come and television don't come. So myself they send message to the health people then. Make them try for visit the health center and do correction. Then the health center will get what in a need which is supposed to get. Right. So what's not the message where they send to the people of Mantoyal community? Okay. Mantua people then. I will send message to Mantua people and tell them say me the chief a day. Anytime they come to me, I will send message to the government concerning the health center. So make them say they alert. We will try for do what we will do for do. Alright, and one more thing before you go. When it gets further with disputes amongst people and the community, as chief, are you can settle them? Well, the dispute, I know they only settle me one green. I deal with me police partnership, but and um, then uh, with the commander with the young people them um, at times i uh, they call them well see them we settle the dispute today among the people them um. okay so what are the message now the final message really sent to the government concerning the health and the water business uh? well are they appealing to the government then uh, look forward to mount Royal, but this water and the health and one police post nearby let them look that side of the back. One police post. Let the place go get peace more and more. Plenty thank you to you, sir. Yeah, yeah, plenty thank you to now. And myself are glad we una bring una radio for come help me for send the message out to the government and to the people. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Good afternoon and welcome to this interview. You go tell me your name and your position at the Mantorial community. Well me your name na Regina Nikus. Commonly known as Junior Niku. Me not the commander for the CSV then amount to the entire Montreal community. Okay, somebody out there will like for know what's the meaning of this CSV? Community safety volunteers. What are the meaning of this CSV? So um as CSV then um commander, what are you experienced so far? Well, maybe don't do to this police police partnership board for a very long time. Since the term of the NPRC government, I've been done doing to this business way, then sending in under CDU with the operate. So, where the other government that come, then decide for call, we back on board table, now build up this police partnership board. I get calls for call to three of my own brother, the whole within the community, for the sake of peace in our own community. I talk with them, I say, let's take up this adventure, let's determine for police this with community, let we see say, the community. They in the answer of peace, let everybody get in your way for go about the normal business. Okay. Speaking of police and peace, we all know say um police now people and where they bring peace now on side and set to dispute. How are not able for bring peace now the Montreal community when they get conflict them through the police help? Well, how will they operate now the Montreal community? I get me see SV them where the number now forty two men in numbers. Normally, I will be don't give we numbers them out, especially me when I the commander, me numbers them they out in the community. So whenever things go wrong, people can contact me if I even are not in the area self. I get me women the way at the operate with me. I can easily call, say so 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 size, so 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 address. When I go there now, problem they day. When I go go move them people and they wanna carry them to the chief. If na issue where we the able handle, we can handle on community level we settle on. If na issue where they above real level where we need police presence, I get the LUC number, I get the ops officer the number from Eastern Police and Ross Road Police Station and the police headquarters also. So I can easily call on the ops officer 
then send personnel at times the ops officer and says he lead in team then come we hand over the people and to them if not police attention we hand over way and the police they will go to the station we can do follow up even in charge to court we don't appear at court with several people and we will not relent just for let us see the right thing they carry on at the community Okay, but um, then on our actions, then Yahweh on can take away disputes and can happen. It don't ever bring a resolve to them disputes and making happen at Mount Oriel. Yeah, it don't bring Boku resolve because some family then they we, we don't already don't fall apart. We don't try, we don't say to them. We even go one matter said, wait tomorrow, I'm not get for you already. The chief, I don't talk to them, I'm going to solve them people and them problem. Because we don't get the both party, we don't talk to them, say, we want going to this issue, we don't set to them community level. And they self don't assure we say they're ready for take waiting whatsoever we tell them for the sake of peace. Okay. Speaking of handling issues then we're not then on our capacity when they left and give the police them for handle. What are some of the issues then the way you feel say no we are not able to handle past the police come inside? Well issue like a wounding because we get bad boys they will be done in the community where they do some bad bad avo cream where they move with cutlass and all that thing. Like they issue then they we not can compromise them. As you pull weapon, when me and my team will apprehend you, then they will not sympathize with that. Definitely, they will see that we match you go direct to the police station because we will not tolerate the acts in the community. Okay. Speaking of teamwork, um, what are some of the constraints they may not to get so far? Well, we don't get a lot of constraints. We make even ourselves, we job door to effective the car, it be effective way we will start. Because of the call for logistics, the way we they need of. We know they will get them. So that makes the operation then don't cease. Even the night patrol will be they do every night. Now all our need don't cut off. Because of we know they get the logistic then we for able to make the co popular operations there. Okay, somebody out there go look for no. What are some of the logistics that may have when I can need? Well look, for logistics, we need medical, we need we need touch lights, batteries, and we also need some moral booster like uh, milk, sugar, and other things because we use for the boil water. Now, next business, the way they challenge coal, you can forget some fuel for the heat the system up. So all that thing and you will not get. So that's good cause for the operation cease. So, when are the message we they send to the people of Montreal community and also to the government? Well, we need to talk to the Montreal people. Um, we don't call, call, call them, permit things there. We don't call on government for let them self respond. Let them show concern. Mount are a very big community. And in long years, people and we don't know the name of this Mount community we don't get in terms of click activities. But with the help of me and my team, they like today, we they make both say Mount Oriel, they under control. Because we get bylaws the way we put now the community way, and then bylaws the way we work with now the community. In terms of abusive language, because now Mount Oriel community now, that complaint in Mitri, you can not pay 100,000 euros to the chief. You fed now Mount Oriel, you complain me through, we owe elect like now you owe you fed. That complaint me through, they go all you. You can not pay 100,000 euros just for no more peace day now the community. So we don't need to do all that thing in there. Let me take it to you, sir. Yeah, thank you too. Welcome. Good afternoon and welcome to this interview. Good afternoon. You, you go tell me your name and what thing you they do? Uh, my name is Yusuf Bangura. And me na a tailor man, and I the show na number six Grand Lane up Eastern Street, Eastern. Okay. So um, living in the new the Mount Oriel community, what are you experienced so far? Well, actually, um, maybe the na Brookfield, but actually, like we don't can live na Mount Oriel, and the people that want miss na Mount Oriel, they hold me fine. And actually, the boss what they work with, they come in a workman at this shop. And my boss named Mariam Asiri Suma. So, he really hold me fine. Then, they want to back and meet. So, the community is very peacefully, but we they go some certain strains. Like, at times, with the open shop for me to get customers. So, it's very difficult for the day for me at least to be able to get one customer for the day. So they go through the in the day. Okay, but um, in the community as a whole, the general community, when I get any constraints, they want to go through. Uh, yeah, we get some because like, when I come, then I don't live here for over six to seven months now. So I don't see some certain things that we at least people then they go through. 
So in terms of water business, because like uh, yeah, water is really hardly for especially this dry season where they come, so it's very difficult. So like the, the drainage, like the gutters, so they experience like mosquitoes, so they experience all anything in malaria. So even me, as I they talk to you right now, I they experience malaria. So na like uh, anything in there. Well, speaking of illness. Um, when una can get affected with any disease, there una get any hospital like where una go and seek aid. Well, actually, what would they get like then kind of thing here for me? I can go na cottage. Na there I can go do me me check up. Then from there, if they prescribe any medicine for me, I get one doctor who at least in back get pharmacy. So if I'm not able to get the drugs na hospital at the government and then he can give me the, the drugs. Alright, that means you get to go as far as um cottage. But then una not get any like um hospital clinic around the Mantuel community or something like Well actually we get clinic who they na um boca really na ya but in una a private so some of them sick then yeah they say we go na a government hospital you go able to get a free but if you go to that clinic day, so uh, maybe you go spend money. So sometimes during the time when you sick, you don't get money. So now that make it can lead we for go to that hospital, even a cottage. Uh, so uh, what are the message where they send to the viewers them out there? Well, actually, because this are the send on to all body, everybody who they list me now, who they hear me, for make at least we na Sierra Leoneans for make could join on for fight any so f- anything so far who they unbog this country for make at least we go come as one. Anything so far where they unbog you, make sure say the next person in back he get wait till the morning and pass you. So you get with that you pass. So if anything more na you now come to one, then we pray to God, God na in the solution of everything. Not put on to anybody, God na in the make it this, na in the make it that. So na, na the message this will get to na all man for me could be as one. Alright, plenty thank you to you. Welcome to you. Sanuna, welcome to the interview, ma. You go tell me your name. My name is Fatima Bangura. Okay, ma. What did they do for a living? What did they do for survive? I don't small, small, my kids there no more for last survive me in the picking there. Okay. But I don't get naughty, I don't get papa, I get but the small, small, my kids there what they do, now they will survive me in there. Okay, mm. How long you don't take now the Mantoyal community? They don't say. They don't say. They don't pass. 20 years now. Okay, so what are your experience so far? Where do they live in this community? Well, live where they live, it's wrong. I not get man. The that man has been died by the war. So, we live in land, not talk about who. We had four picking and I get now. We want to not get man. Okay. Um, now, this community, what are the constraints them they want to go through? What's he? Now the things the way they mourn and own the community. Well, for somebody school no more. Since Ranga, everybody, but they say alarm the rely, but things wrong. But we see and then they no more. Okay, we don't talk to the chief and other people and then sell we but I want to strain for water. How you can do for get water? Well, Sunday we get water and I get it then two days, three days before ever they get water. My house out there and I, man, so a lot of day. If you then count water, we they buy the rubber, 2,000, 1,000. One gallon water? For one gallon water. They know, and they know the more the money we up here and You talk about you picking them and also the school challenge. Um, How the school can do, I mean, for like, put picking them in school, how can can able for put on a picking them at the Mount Royal Community School? Well, in the beginning, I need a strain for them. I need, I need to put them in a school. I need a strain, man, not day. You see? Because I didn't see to where this year, but I know you pull nothing. You see? The other hand back, the back, I know you pull. That's why I repeat hand back. And round the back, the money, me, they cannot get help. And round the no more. So, what now the message you sent to the government? So let them help me by the school with the water business back. Okay. But then you know say um the government of Sierra Leone don't come with um free education for picking them. Yes, we know that and they but now me other picking and maybe they pay for her. See? And maybe they pay. 
Although they say free education, I mean they pay less if all the all the I mean they pay. Mm -hmm. What are the final what will you get for say? La la de epi. Do ya with the big papa government le epi. Do ya we will not get man. See, me like me now na the carry age now. See, do ya na bandi no more. Plenty checking to you, yeah. Uh, they sell them. Thank you. Let them get well body and long life for the help we more and more. The country, we are mostly we don't we'll not get money again. We are the big papa government. We are so now that's no more. Uh, thank you. Uh. Good afternoon and welcome to this interview. You go tell me your name and your occupation. My name is David MCC. I'm a teacher and the head teacher of Inside Primary School. Okay, um, as the head teacher, but how long have you been in that position? I've been for over nine years now in the position. Okay, so what's your experience so far? My experience is many. Um, I've learned a much about this community, but this community lacks many, many things. Many, many things as one of the key things is water shortage. Water shortage is the key to this community and also road network. Road network, if this ill bypass road can ease the problem, but up to now they have not finished it yet. Okay, um, sir, what exactly is the name of this school? The name of this school is Inside Primary School, Mount Royal Grant Lane. Um, being the fact that it's located in Mount Oriel and uh, where water is very scarce, what have been your survival? Yeah, our survival is to we buy water by rubber. What two thousand yen by rubber? That is our survival. We buy water from people that fetch water from the tap downstairs, and they come up and sell it to us. So that's our survival of water. Okay, this um, money that you used to buy the water, is it coming out of the pocket of the principal or is it coming directly from the student? It's coming from the people, from the people who collect it on Friday basis, 500 in each class, throughout the week. Then we buy the water by days. Um, what are the constraints you've been going through with the people in this school? Well, the constraints are many. Government is not assisting us one way or the other by supplying school materials and other things okay. how um has this school been beneficial to the mantorial community and this school is more beneficial to the mantorial community because this is a school that have taken a long time in this community we have got the primary and also have opened the secondary also and this school have been so good to this community because we have provided many many education to children for this community especially the parents okay, um, speaking of the president platform of free education is your school um part of it or are you collecting fees um at least we are not part of the free education but at least they supply or they give us some things that will beneficial to the children so what's your message to the government out there? I'm appealing to the government that let, her, let them come to our aid, especially for the school material. Let them supply school material to the children so that they can that so that the teacher can able to teach the children so that they will understand. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you too. Good afternoon sir and welcome to this interview. You go tell your name and your occupation. Okay. I'm a teacher and I'm uh, last name sorry. Understand. Uh, at the church at Inside Primary School. Uh, I don't take up to four years at this school um, after as it was because there was no way no be for me to go college early as possible. So I decided for Kana Inside Primary School for campaign and um, money so that I go for go college, you understand? But anyway, the school we get some constraints at the school. One of the constraints is that water supply and one of the problems the greatest problem in the because the community as a whole, in the Montreal community, water supply not in a, We don't cry to government, let government help you towards water, but only you see no output, understand? So that's not one of the problems. Secondly, the school lack of toilet facility. The students are restrained, you can they are restrained. There is no good facility for them to eat themselves, understand? 
So that like you know the teacher is with the strength was that you understand. And thirdly and thirdly, we the teacher and sister will not get office at the school. Understand? And we will be proper government for make go help we make you for construct the school for we as you see the school in Cambodia for now. So we pray to government and the big arm for make go help we let God give them the chance for let the help we so that they will for construct the school for we. So the school will be good for we. Because the school and they do well now the community. In the field of uh, external exams, MPSC and uh, the others exams, you understand? Will they do well? For instance, this past uh, MPSC wouldn't take, the school scored great mark. The first man of school get um, 343. Okay, and um, so what are the messages they send to viewers out there? Well, we, the message is sent to the government and let me just say any community stakeholders in the areas. At the big thing, they are letting help you for them to develop the school. Let this could go grow from this day to another level. Right. Plenty take it to you, sir. Welcome. Welcome to this interview, sir. Lieutenant. Yeah, you go tell me your name Welcome. and your occupation. My name is Edmund Levy. I'm a health consultant. I train in Ghana, I train in China. And I even not only deal with Haba products. And Haba products, yeah, some of them, they are them very good. So now that will come up my to today for can do marketing for tell people about the harbor, the kind of sickness where they treat. That bring we can up here today. Okay, um how this get for be a beneficial something to the material community? Well the beneficial are great. One, the way they sell all in our office is different for Ukanaya. Then Ukanaya, why would they tell the people about the product, tell the sickness where they where they treat everything? Then some hey, we get the sickness, we don't go do tests, we get the sickness. We can mark the product for them buy. So we're not able, we can divide the middle and buy the town, they can buy the balance back. Okay, um, you talk of office and the product. What's in the name of this office and what's in the name of the product on the sale? Well, the name of the office now Long Reach. They would do Panemba Road, it took Panemba Road. Then we they deal with different kind, we get like paste. For anybody we we get problem with the mouth, we get mouth odor, for them teeth and strong. We get the pistol they use. We get some type body they scratch, scratch to get body wash. Who can use where they use our inside a product for wash your body. They will get product and like berry oil. It's very, very, very good. It treat any type of ulcer, even cancer, they treat uh, hepatitis. This product they even help for treat the heart. They will get other product and like Uma we know they we get problem with menstruation. So you get this pad, what they call them magnetic pad. Where they inside time you withdraw, make all the infection in the system. They don't own that number. Even you sus where they wear. If you get sent, bad, bad sent, they pull it, they think come on, you put on it, and they cure down on it. If you get boil, you pull a lamp at the boil, lamp, all that they help. So we get different, different colors. We get like this we call Atro Super Viva. Viva. This it will help for pain, then joint pain them. They still, it will even help. If you get cataract now, yeah, they help assist that so into one the product. They'll get like this long reach coffee. We call a concept coffee. They treat asthma. The woman will get regular menstruation. Then she wanna spot people then. So we'll get a lot lot of more. Okay, um when I don't get any evidence of people then we don't they use them product here and actually it work for them. We get boku boku evidence is them. We get boku boku. We get somebody when no money for call name because the person will like that. We get some who get heart problem, who don't treat it don't well. We get some who get chronic pain, chronic ulcer, where they don't treat them beaucoup. Okay, you and see? from where we come now, the Mount Oil community, we don't get anybody like where they in search of them products there. Where well, we don't come, obviously we can't lit, but we can't. We don't talk to community them. We get some who don't buy the tea, like now we get a tea we call green tea. This is the main pie. They the main um, any constipation. Then they treat any sickness than the belly. They call sir. They even they make the belly good or the belly too big. So one man can, one lady, woman can we explain to them. They don't buy one. They sort of promise after prayer that they come. They even get soup. We get rash in the body. We will they use? We will they call charcoal. Now charcoal then take me camp. Very good. Get a lot of one then. All right. And if person one for purchase them products, I will go for each una. Well, you reach winner, it's two Panemba Road, or we can get a complimentary card. Them we could call, we go get distributors. Them with the out, we can send. I was the more we carry after that, they will know about them. Um, 
when una come na Mount Royal community, they una get any plans of like building a small store na Mount Royal community? Well, we see a turn up day. We get one of them, man, we we'll call Ben Ba, we we'll get, we'll get a Ben Acha, we we'll have the same day. Then, then, then more invite we come and talk to the community, then the blue will come. If you see, say, the people they need, they need them, we we'll get a small office for them, I will then go, they will supply the product to them, and that's more we come for. Um, if somebody wants to reach you personally for this product, I will get you, go send number for them. Well, my number is 076-651-049. Then the office is 077 43 Forty-four, fifty-five. I need to know the mail I can use. Uh, plenty, thank you. Right, thank you, Seth. Thank you very much. Now, Seth, don't listen. The chief, what did he get for say? Concerning the constraints they wanted to go through. Now, this Montreal community, we get for do with water and other facilities they wouldn't lack. And also from the security people them, but how they fight forget peace now the Montreal community. May I bring this program come to you. Me on name Nakona Sisi. So till we meet again to another edition of Talk to the Camera. I say tata.